say what it is we're doing? Hi, uh, my name's Sean, and we're showing off at the Adobe booth, Adobe Photoshop Touch. So everything is stored in the cloud on Creative Cloud, and uh, we're going to open up and make a movie poster right here on the iPad. So if you'll notice, right down here on the side, we've got the ability to add different layers. We can transform and warp those layers. We can change the color and contrast. Um, I think we're going to do zombies, though. So let's add zombies up there. And we're going to select down at the very bottom a blank layer, and we're going to photograph into that layer using, excuse me, let's cancel out of that, what's known as camera fill. And when we do that, we now have a layer that can be edited and added. So let's walk over here for a second. So we've got zombies, and we've got... Zombies that we can then add in to our Photoshop document as its own new layer. Say, for example, we didn't want that text at the top easy, we can just black it out. We're going to come here, we're going to add a little bit of color, take our brightness out, make sure that our opacity is up really high, and then just paint right over the top of it. Size, there we go, hardness. And good. Okay. Yeah, where we? There we go. Cool. So we can black all that out at the top. Then we can uh, make an adjustment on this. We can come in here and make a comic esque effect to this. Like that right there, maybe bring up a little bit of edge detail. <laughs> Just like that right there, ooh, that's pretty scary. Maybe we need a little bit of saturation in there, so we're gonna come up here and crank in a little bit of extra saturation, or maybe we can desaturate it a little bit. I'm gonna add just a little bit of contrast to this guy. And maybe add a little bit of red in there. And now we've got our own new movie poster right there inside of Adobe Photoshop Touch that you can then save and send to friends uh, via email, Facebook, Flickr, Twitter, etc. All through the iPad, syncs to your desktop so you can start working on it in Photoshop at home and you're good to go. And just for you viewers out there, it is $9.99 for the app. $9.99, that's it.